Hey folks, KC7 here. Welcome back to the channel. Yeah, welcome back to the chicken train. No, actually, of course, it is uh, Silver Run Forest and Farm Sim 22. But yeah, this... Uh, I don't know that uh, I want to take responsibility for actually outright killing an AI by having them smashed to bits by a train. So we may just have to do this field by ourselves. Hope everybody's doing well. It is uh, a Sunday morning here on the beautiful Sunshine Coast of British Columbia. Indeed. If you're new to the channel and you like the content or the other content I put up, make sure you uh, hit that subscribe and the notification bell. And of course, if you like the video, hit the like button. Alright, that gets that edge. Uh, yeah, I think I'm going to have to pretty much run a headland around this entire puppy. Even if I do do it myself. Not the headland, the actual field. I mean, I'd like to get a hired worker to do it, then we could be out picking up the straw out of the other field. But, that's probably not going to happen. This field is just a little too snug in the forest. Well, it used to be forest, so, yeah. something completely different. Oh, will I fit or am I being a complete twat? Please fit, please fit. Oh, you don't fit. Dang! Here I thought I had it all worked out. Uh, yeah, there's no way you're gonna fit through the other side either. Well, so much for the best laid plans and all of that. When you spit the more straw out, just because you can, huh? It's like clearing your throat or something? Hmm. Alright, let's head down the road. Or Lubberly Forest. Quite a... Quite a nice thing to leave behind for the, uh the town to enjoy. Alright, here's where I was trying to get to. Believe it or not. Okay. Because I had this weird idea in my head that this will work out better. Alright. 
How are we doing here? 82%. So we'll definitely be filled up on this row. So we'll get a couple of trailers out of this field. That's not bad. Again, not enough to run any sort of a factory for any length of time. But it's not bad. I wonder where uh, our tractor and trailer are. They may well still be sitting with uh, goodies in them. Whoops. 99 and over the limit we go. Alright, you can just pipe out whilst I... Look what I found. And guess what? Yeah. It's got stuff in it. It's got granola. Or maybe even canola. Who are we to be fussy? Okay. Go past the... Uh, Weed acres and uh, go dump this in the silo. It will become a part of our final sales. Of course, you don't expect to get a super big yield with canola, so we did all right. In fact, all the fields did all right. You know, it's it's certainly a uh, a fairly rich area as far as the soil goes. Not too bad. Okay, that's an interesting place to leave that. There we are, we made it anyway. Despite the best efforts. <laughs> okay. Out of the harvester. Indeed. Pretend to back up. That's as far as we can go because we're probably jackknifed already. And. with you. Alright. Even the load out a little bit. Alright. Do the last 10 meters here. Yoink. Beautiful. Mm, you can fire that down. Alright. Yeah, I don't know that we'll fill the trailer. Hmm. And it's not like that's a huge trailer. Although, I mean, 30,000, surprisingly enough. That's uh, pretty big with what's on offer. I was looking at uh, various trucks with uh, tipper options on them for the next map. And, uh, 
I was quite surprised most of them were topping out in the 20 to just over 20,000 liter plus range. You know, 23,000 was, uh, you know, would be the largest in the line. Or, so, yeah. Perhaps at 30k, that trailer is uh, quite a big beastie. Not a not a number you can actually I guess physically imagine unless you drive those things for a, li a living. You know, I mean, yeah, I can imagine what a kilo of wheat seed looks like. Probably even a ten or twenty kilo bag of wheat seeds, but thirty thousand. <laughs> you know, um, well, yeah, it'd be a really rough guess at best. Ooh, I managed to sleaze those edges in. I'm so proud of myself. All right, here we go. Now this, we got a ways to go, so. Hasn't got a whole lot going on in reverse, eh? Hmm. All right, well, fair enough, I guess. Figured once I got the two headlands in, the field would be considerably shorter this way than the other way. So, should give us just enough space to do this. Perfect. And yoink! There we go. Yeah, not a lot of space down there, eh? I think I'm actually gonna go for the big turn this time. There we go. And yoink. Just easier in that tight space to go for the longer, longer corner. And here we are. About to harvest the last row of our last field. Then once we dump this in the silo, we'll have a look at what our totals were. Because other than a little bit of wheat that we fed to the chickens, it'll give us a pretty, uh, and you'll see what I mean, that we're not exactly uh, qualified to be running factories. Yeah, the oats didn't come in that high, unfortunately. What does it get? 8,000 each time? So, yeah. Around 14 in total. That ain't gonna feed a lot of anything. Ooh, check the fuel out in the uh, harvester. <laughs> yeah. Talk about taking her down to the last. Uh, the 
Oh well. We are going to sell it. I don't want to go selling all that or giving away all that fuel. It's not like we're going to get any missions. So there we go. <laughs> like they'd stop, eh? <laughs> uh, I don't think so. Alright, here we go. We will start with this. $45,000? Good lord. Yeah? yeah. Okay. The trailer... The trailer's ten grand? Man! We had some expensive kit, eh? And then 115 for that. Alright. Okay. There we go, 172 thou for the harvester system. Well now... I'm sure the combination of Everything we've harvested would not add up to that. I can see why, uh, you know. Even if you're a little well off to start with, farming can drain your wallet pretty good. <laughs> Alright, uh, yeah, what the heck. Take the cynic root. Thirteen thousand in oats, eh? So seventy k in wheat, fifty one barley, forty in canola, and thirteen well fourteen. Hmm. So less than a couple hundred thousand. Wow. That certainly would not. It wouldn't have paid for the trailer. <laughs> well, I don't know. Maybe the trailer. All right. Let's go. Speaking of trailers, it's time to swap trailers. Over next door. Blah, blah. I wouldn't be too surprised to see this forage wagon make it onto the next map. It's a little hard on the uh, sharp corners, but it's got such a nice wide rake on it. Uh, I'm a man that can appreciate a wide rake. Alright. 
down with the brush, on with the motor. What sucks draw. That's what I mean about being a bit hard on the corners. <laughs> No, I think there's a mod for that. I just don't have it installed. Basically ignores the uh, overlap that the tongue and the actual hitch might end up having. Yeah, all in all, the oats is a little disappointing, isn't it? We didn't get much crop, and we're not going to get that much straw. But, I'm glad to have it, because otherwise, the oats would have been even less worth our time. Okay, this, uh... This field would probably get a little bit of straightening out if this was going to be sort of where we hung out for a long time yet. I can see that. Okay, where can I, can I turn around here? Boy, I got a bunch of junk in the way, don't I? Great demand at the fire department. For what? Fires? You want me to set fire to my wheat? Okay, we are full. Nice. figure we sold all the last stuff at the market so <coughs> excuse me <coughs> probably pretty saturated by now <coughs> oh. <clears throat> there we go Lovely. how's that train she ain't a coming. Nope. Good stuff. Alright, let's keep going here. Oh, I didn't even notice. Darn. I didn't look at the numbers. <laughs> oh well. We'll fill one more at least, I'm sure. I want to get this end one out of here. So... Uh, let's do that. Good stuff. Grab the rest of this. Look out, Bambies. Coming through. Mm. 
bum bum. Ooh. Well, aren't you lucky? A little burst of wheat there. Uh, what is this? Oh, it's a grand total of like 20 liters. Okay. Let's head down to the bottom. Where are you at, Nerf? We are getting there. Three row left, eh? Well, I don't know whether it'll all fit. No. No train, good stuff. Bump, bump. Give these guys a shot at it. I'm gonna actually look at the numbers this time, see what we make. Uh, 36, eh? Hmm. I thought we were getting a little closer to 5 before. Oh, train? Nope. Good. So the last field harvested. That took a while. It took quite a while. Not as long as our little miniature forest is going to take, but still. Ah. Not going to bother with that little nugget-sized bit. Yeah, I really don't know what they were doing with these ground textures, so that's just awful. <laughs> I mean, the field textures and stuff are okay, but boy, oh boy. That forest floor leaves uh, a lot to be desired. It looks like something out of FS13. That's her. Well, you know, for that field. Not bad, still going good.
And here we are. But, I think we've, uh, probably about come to the end of the episode. So, I do thank all of you for joining me here today. Hope you enjoyed. We've, uh, yeah, that's the last harvest in the silo. All that's left now is to, uh, sell them all off. So, we will see you in the next one. Take care of each other. Hit that like button. And ciao for now.